Here in front of us we have several types of minerals. They all appear in different shapes and sizes and colors. It's our job to try to identify these minerals. So how do we go about identifying various minerals? As stated by your UPCO book, a mineral is a naturally occurring solid inorganic substance that has definite chemical composition and molecular As structure. previously stated, minerals are defined by their physical or atomic structure and their chemical composition. But how do we go about identifying minerals? Well, we have to look at certain physical features to help us identify minerals. Now, one of the things I think that is useful to identify the mineral is knowing if the mineral has cleavage. And I stated in your UPCO book, cleavage is a tendency of a mineral to split along one or more smooth, flat surfaces or planes. Now, here's a mineral that has cleavage. And if you notice, it has flat, smooth surfaces. Also, the surfaces or the sides are parallel to each other. Okay, so here's an example, a perfect example of cleavage. So essentially, you'll be looking for minerals that have flat, smooth surfaces or lines that are parallel or sides that are parallel to each other. If you can recognize that, then that particular mineral that you're looking at has cleavage. Now here's a miniature version of the previous mineral. Now again, it has cleavage. Now, if I break this mineral, notice what happens. Again, the smaller pieces appear to have flat, smooth surface. It's exhibiting cleavage. Here we have a mineral, Muscovite mica. And if you look at it, uh, it's very flat. Obviously, it's very flat. And believe it or not, this also, this mineral also exhibits cleavage. Because this particular mineral peels. It peels off in flat layers or in thin sheets. And again, by definition, cleavage is the tendency of a mineral to split along one or more smooth flat surfaces or planes. As you observe, you have this layer of Muscovite mica peeling off along a flat along a flat plane or smooth surface, thus exhibiting cleavage. Now here we have two examples of two minerals that do not exhibit cleavage. Instead they exhibit fracture. Now fracture refers to when when a mineral or uneven or have an appearance that is uneven or rough. When you look closely at this particular mineral, it doesn't have cleavage obviously. It doesn't have a flat smooth surface. It looks irregular shape. It's uneven. Okay, so it's fractured. Same thing with this mineral here. You don't it doesn't have flat surfaces. The sides aren't necessarily parallel to each other. Again, it's exhibiting fracture. 